So now I am back in Audacity, and today we are going to be covering how to remove vocals. So I'm going to go in here, I'm going to import audio. And uh, yeah, we have this. I'm um, going to go in deep dive here, I think. It's a bit too much. Okay, we're gonna go here. I'm gonna look for an audio, and I think it's around this point where uh, where there's actually vocals. Okay, so we have this, we need effects, and we've got to go to vocal reduction and isolation. So I'm just going to work on this segment right here. Um, I recommend not touching these at all, uh, just, just because, and um, yeah, I'm going to click OK. And look at that. Let's play this back. All right, you can at least see that there was a significant reduction. All right, let's actually play with this a little more. Strength one, let's... See if this makes a difference. Yeah, and you may not have heard this as well, um, uh, but it's definitely uh, a little lower. Maybe uh, if I just de-amplify this a bit. Actually, hold up on that. Okay, and, and then you just raise it for the higher ones as well. Um, but I say just keep your defaults um, where they were. Um, and I'll be sure to... Yeah, and, and you're going to wind up like this. And I'm actually going to go back there and... Um, Yeah, the standard 9,000, or just type it in here. 120, and I think this was like 1.0. Yeah. Now I'll add that effect. Okay, but that is the idea of this. And, uh, and I recommend don't play around with it because you're gonna, it can get too low at a certain point. Um, so keep the standard, um, if you're gonna have vocals and, yeah, just bring in, bring it in and reduce the, reduce the decibel levels before you do anything else, um, and that goes for the whole track. Um, let me know if you have any questions or concerns, and, uh, I will see you all in the next video.